Hello everyone, Alpha Soul here with a weekly news update for Ashes of Creation for the week starting on March 18th, 2019. It's been a while since I've made some videos and I apologize, I really got bogged down with a ton of work. It's the end of the quarterly increment and being perfectly honest, I actually got bogged down playing two other games. Uh, I was fully into Anthem when it first came out and now I am into The Division 2 uh, and playing those as a filler of time. Uh, so a lot has actually happened since the beginning of March. Uh, so I'm actually going to have multiple videos covering each and every single thing uh, that I'm actually mentioning here in the weekly news update. So I'm really just only going to briefly touch on the topics here. Uh, this is really meant to be just uh, an update video more for people uh, who aren't following Ashes of Creation as much. Uh, so that's pretty much it, guys. Uh, again, a lot has happened since the start of March. Uh, and without any further delay, let's just go ahead and get into the video. Now, the very first item that we have here is the creative director's letter. Uh, I had mentioned earlier in a previous news update that uh, they were creating, by they, I mean Intrepid Studios, were creating a creative director's letter to kind of explain the goings-ons of what has actually happened. Now, there was a lot of speculation even going into the creative director's letter that there was going to be a delay, so everyone really wanted to know what was actually happening and what was going to happen, and... I have to say that the creative director's letter wasn't what I was expecting. Now, there was a lot of information in there specifically for somebody who is not following Ashes of Creation, uh, but for people who are following it, I felt that the letter did not give uh, as much as I would like info in it. In fact, the main thing that I kind of took away from it was, yes, there is a delay, uh, and the delay is less than a year, but it's more of a month's delay. You just don't know how long. So ended up with questions as well, but I will go fully into the creative director's letter in a separate video. The next topic is there, after that creative director's letter, there was an impromptu chat that Steven had uh, in Discord to kind of uh, talk with people, only because once the creative director's letter was released, to say that there was a lot of disappointment and outrage uh, would probably be an understatement for what actually occurred. Uh, and, you know, to Stephen's credit and Intrepid's credit, they had this uh, impromptu chat on Discord where a lot of people vented their frustrations and, you know, asked some pointed questions and Stephen was there to answer them. Uh, so I'll touch on that. There are a couple of summaries around uh, and I will actually have that linked down below as well, too. Uh, but I will have a separate video on that as well. The next topic, uh, there was a live stream on that same corrective or uh, director's letter, the creative director's letter that was released, and uh, in it, it was more the public forum for Intrepid to answer any questions and to kind of outlay and relay the vision that they had uh, regarding and have regarding Ashes of Creation, how that's changed, what they've learned from APOC, things of that nature, uh, and there will be a summary on that. The next bit of news is uh, regarding the first of two blogs that they also had up, uh, which was 10 facts about castle sieges. Now, uh, this is castle sieges specifically within the MMO and not necessarily within APOC. Uh, so it was uh, a much needed, you know, refresh, I guess you could say, of content coming across for the MMO. Now, uh, it, it was one point of, you know, uh, I guess direction uh, that a lot of people, uh, you know, said basically and that uh, was absolutely true there was, really wasn't that much info coming out on the mmo it was all apocalypse here apocalypse there but not really much info about the mmo and this was really the first bit of content uh in a while uh, about the mmo just really targeted at the mmo and uh, i think it's a, a step in the right direction and it appears that they're you know releasing content in a steady flow as they promised from the director's letter again more on that sorry to delay and finally, the last bit of info is another blog, again, was released called Know Your Nose. And this was, uh, March was supposed to be the month, or is supposed to be the month of node information. And we're already about halfway through March. Um, and uh, this is our, you know, bit of node information, the first bit of node information. So we'll probably be seeing more as this was actually released, I believe, on Saturday. Uh, and so, um, you know, we... we won't just expect for things for Monday through Friday, but it looks like we can start seeing some things on some weekends as well, too. Uh, but the Know Your Nodes kind of gives an introduction about nodes and also kind of outlines some things that uh, previously had not been released, as well as just kind of sums up some of the other stuff. 
So that concludes this news for this week, everyone. If there was any news that I missed or something you feel like sharing, please feel free, feel free to leave a comment down below and let us know. Thanks for tuning in and have a great day, everyone. Alpha Soul out. Oh, <laughs>